Fire officials say with warming temperatures, you should avoid ice as it may appear to be thick enough to go out on, but it is melting. ABC 17's Victoria Bragg is live at Stevens Lake Park where the lake was open for ice skating and activities until this Thursday. In Victoria, officials say there are safety precautions to take if you do plan on still going out on that ice. Connor, fire officials do not recommend going out on ice as temperatures are warming up. But for those planning to take a risk on ice, officials say that you need to always have someone with you and you need to know what to do just in case you fall through. Though some parks like Stevens Lake have closed ice activities, some are still planning to venture out and take advantage of icy conditions in other areas. Officials say you need to ensure ice is thick enough with at least a four inch depth. And if you're planning to go out on ice, always make sure to have someone with you and never go alone. Brad Frazier, Columbia's assistant fire chief, says if someone were to fall through the ice, the best thing to do is immediately call 911 and never go in after them. If someone were to fall into the ice, fall through the ice, rather, it's very important to call 911 immediately. Don't try to go out and retrieve a person that's fallen through the ice or a pet for that matter. Gail Bloomingcamp with Boone County Fire Protection says you can safely try to extend an object to someone who has fallen in to bring them back to shore. If you're with somebody that goes through the ice, do not attempt to go out there and get them. One person's already fallen in, that ice is not going to hold you either. Try to extend something to them, um, like a ladder. You can throw a rope to them, try to pull them out. Um, jumper cables out of your car if you're close enough. Blooming Camp says if you happen to fall through the ice and no one is around to help, try to lift yourself back up to the ice surface. Um, if you're the one that falls through, immediately turn around. Try to lay your hands out flat on this on the ice surface and try to kick your feet and get yourself back up on the ice. <clears throat> Once you're on the ice, roll yourself back to shore. Blooming Camp says if you can, take long nails or ice picks with you to help pull yourself back up if you fall in. But the best thing to do is just avoid ice with warming temperatures. You, you really want to try to avoid getting on the ice now so the, the temperatures are starting to warm. Officials also say to keep your pets on a leash when around bodies of water or ice as many people have endangered themselves by trying to save pets who have fallen through ice. Reporting live in Columbia, I'm Victoria Bragg, ABC 17 News.